the Diamond in the Rough and um, I've had to do voiceover um, my sound on this uh, my recording this unboxing was shocking um, what I do have is a well two diamond paintings from DIY Moon um, I ordered this um, good question Hang on, I, when did I order this? That might help if, help you guys. Um, I'll pop the details here of when I ordered it. Okay, but we have two diamond paintings in here. Um, before even unboxing, I know that there is, there's me showing, please handle with care, showing how well that's packaged and boxed. This was sent by DHL. Um, it is expensive. Diamond, product, diamond painting products but it is also expensive um, postage um, so <clears throat> I will put the link to both of these diamond paintings um, down below um, if you want to have a look and be horrified at how much I spent but um, I look at it as I did a blank custom so the, the blank custom that I purchased so with all the pieces that I've put together, it's cost me more than the most expensive one of these two diamond paintings. So I justify it that way. This was, um, it's a three to four weight because it's a special, what's called a special order. I, um, it only took, I think about two weeks for that. Um, and it was shipped on Friday got notified shipping and that it would arrive Monday I had it so therefore it's gonna take what four days to get here because I was on day shift I actually put a request in to have it delivered on Wednesday which I did and that's when it arrived but four days delivery um, which is really really good so um, another link that I will put in is from DIY Moon, they're actually on their boxing vlog where they actually box these up. And even before I open this up, I um, know that there is 45 colours in each because you get to see. There's me pointing, saying I'll try to put this stuff in the information tag. Um, I don't know whether my dog, sound of my dog walking is coming over this microphone. Um, but yeah. I'm trying to work out the best way to open this. Now that clever cutter makes light work of anything, but I just, <laughs> I'm trying to find the point where I can actually stick it in. And you see, I'm absolutely struggling with it. <laughs> Very well packaged. There we go. I think I've, that's where the point where I found it. It worked really well. There we go. If you ever get the ability to get your hands on one of these clever cutters, I really do recommend it. They make things so much easier. So much easier when it comes to unboxing stuff. But then again, I slid that all the way down the side <clears throat> and I didn't need it on the side. <laughs> I didn't know how that box opened up. Um, only opened up on one end in the long run but I just battled to try and find out work out how to open it there we go I dropped it um, so yeah DIY moon there is some really nice pieces and they are in collaboration with artists and there we go it's a box inside of a box shake it out and yet again, that box, that next one, that's actually wrapping paper. Box is empty. Um, wrapping paper covered in plastic. So yet again, another layer of protection. When they box up and show on the video, on the vlog, you can see my name go on it. You can see the DIY moon sticker that goes on it. And there we go. There's me talking about how we watch, a, watch them wrap it. Um, which is really good process. You can see what's in there. Um, there we go. There's the clever cutter doing its job the best way it can. Okay, 
enough silence. I'm still semi um, just coming off night shift, so my eyes are hanging out of my head again. Um, so yeah, there we go. I've gotten it out. You can see my name is on there. And just saying how good that clever cutter took that off without any issues, no ripping of the paper. Okay. It's hard to believe that I talk all the way through. There's me showing that's the really pretty, really pretty paper. Um, turning it around, uh, showing how it's really well taped. And yep, making light work of the sticky tape without damaging the wrapper. It's really good. So yeah, there is guys do um, collaboration with artists and then you can do special orders on top of. Um, I've just seen a heap of YouTubers showing what's called sparklers um, with DIY Moon. They've had them for a while. They actually call them, um, when you use them, electrifying. So you electrify your diamond painting with um, these sparklers. So that's what I actually did order, uh, you know, what, three, four weeks ago, whatever, when I ordered it. Um, so I actually ordered diamond paintings to have these actually on the diamond painting specifically. Okay, so there we go. Papers out, all good, all intact, all in one. If I want to use it again, I probably can, but there's my name and there's DIY Moon logo. Okay, just throwing that out of the way. Well, no, placing it out of the way is more like it. Now I'm trying to work out which box do I open. On the end, they've um, bubble wrapped the end of it. The box was not big enough. So they did bubble wrap the end of it. Um, and I wasn't sure which one was it in these boxes um gosh who knows what i'm talking about there i have no idea what i'm talking about there but there we go the bubble wrap is on there protecting that end i'm just gonna yet again rip that tape off And you can see the diamond painting actually sticking out and the box lid is actually taped to stay around it too. So that then um, that is, there's, you know, the bubble wraps one form of protection uh, but the cardboard is the other. Yeah, so bring pleasure into your everyday life. There was the um, steps on becoming a diamond painting, getting a double diamond painting addiction um, on there, and which one is which. So they're trying to work out which one to go with, and then I've gone, righty, I'll go with the one that's got the box already open. Okay, so put one aside and open up the first one. So this one is Girl by Carousel with electric lights. And the electric lights is in relation to the um, beautiful sparkling drills. I have unrolled this that way because the drills are on the inside, but I'm looking at the canvas. There's canvas is in perfect condition. And I know we do get there and say with the clear covers, you're just about guaranteed to have a good canvas. Um, I will say though that I have received one canvas with poured glue and the canvas was shocking. Um, and I did have to iron it and sort it out. Okay, so two bags of drills. You will see that um, it, those drills actually do have Girl with Carousel on them one of two, two of two, and also my name on them. 
Okay. And that's me pulling that up so you can see that that is uh, not focusing well. I had so much fun with the focus, but there we go. Me, now I'm telling you they're there because I couldn't show you. There's quite a few baggies in there, lots of baggies. I didn't count the baggies, but there's a lot of baggies there. So if I was not going to put them in my packaging, um, I believe there's enough baggies there. And this is where I get excited. <laughs> I start taking these out of the packaging and notice that these are all in order. There was no having to sort no sorting whatsoever and for me that is I think if you hear me when I unbox stuff it's one of the things that I look for is that having stuff in order so these were packaged in DMC order which I was so wrapped with and packaged nicely um, Yet again, when you watch the vlog, you can see them all laid out and you'll have my name and then whoever packed it up, um, their name is also there as well. Okay, so there we go. I'm all done. I'm all happy, <laughs> all excited. Um, and just talking a bit more about the drill. So this is a these are both round diamond paintings. Um, and yeah loving the fact that these are in order i do waffle on now this one i didn't try to get back in the bag because this is going to be kitted up in the next couple of days so something i do like to do is put them into these containers and then as soon as i'm ready to kit up i kit it up and it's just one less step of getting them out of the bags um one thing that isn't there on this diamond painting is there is no inventory sheet the symbols the legend on the side isn't oh i hope you did can you'll hear my dog even on this microphone i believe um <laughs> there's quite a few there 45 colors um yes yeah, so the legend on the side with all the symbols and the dmc colors is quite small so i will I'll do yet again because there's no inventory sheet i'll have to take pictures and then send it to my printer and print the um, print them out so that i can put them in through my label maker okay so I'm nearly there maybe I should have sped that bit up but I think what I was telling you was very I must have believed it was important when I've done this editing when I did the first lot of editing I am just trying to fit them into that container because there's just so many drills there so girl by carousel um, I disappear I'm trying to tuck that down to try and get the plastic over it Disappear, grab a piece of paper, write on it, and then um, secure it that way. Don't you like my messy writing? I'm shocking at writing. Okay. So easy when you've got an inventory sheet. Because <laughs> that inventory sheet would have just gone directly over it. Mm. Yeah, no issue, no issue at all. But anyway, so I put that over and I'll move that to the side, get that out of the way so I can show you the canvas. No, oh, excuse me, I just yawned, sorry. Alrighty, are you ready for it? Just move things out the way and around it comes. So this one is a 100 wide by 67 high. It's girl by carousel. Now this is going to go directly. <laughs> See the size of my hands gives you an idea of the size of this canvas. But yet again, I do love my big canvas. What I'm pointing out is the lights 
So that is where the electrified, I will electrify it with the um, beautiful sparkling details. It's sticky. The symbols, when I eventually get it to focus, so being around, the, the I just struggle with my camera. It's around, there is no circles there and the ink behind is in square, which means that um, the color that the diamonds are, the drills are, will um, the background will blend in. So, which is really great, really great. But when this one's completed, it's going on the wall behind me so that when you, I do the vlogs, you will actually see it. So I'm measuring it and it is true to size. It is this, it was, I think it worked out 66.8 pi and it was smack on the 100 wide. So, you know, that was, they're really good in that way. Um, clear cover, which is poured glue. The symbol, so you can see how the legend is pretty small there. The actual symbols themselves are the simplistic symbols, which is the alphabetical and numerical with, here we go, try and focus. <laughs> there we go. Um, and with very basic symbols um, that we've uh, seen around the place. Oh. Okay, so that's that. Um, yeah, it is gorgeous. Okay. So now I think I pick this one up and put it aside. No, I'm pointing out the fact that the plastic doesn't go... There is actually two sheets of plastic on this. So I'm not sure what's happened there, but yeah, two sheets of plastic. Radio. And it looks like it's indoors by the look of that picture. It looks like it is in, indoors in a greenhouse of some sort. Okay, so now putting that one away. Oh, there we go, another yawn. Apologies there. So, which means this one in this box is Elsa version B, and I had that one electrified. In the boxing vlog, um, they with both of them, they show where the, the sparklers go. Um, and um, with Elsa, they give you a couple of versions. So here we go. This has got the canvas coming out. Nothing in the box. Okay, so as a first time boat purchaser from DIY Moon, they give you this little case. So it's a, it's, I still can't describe it. It's, it's soft and spongy. Um, and yeah, it's not, not a bad size when it comes to the boats going in there and that. And the drills, the petrol kit is in that gorgeous panda bag, which is really, really sweet. What I get in there is four drill pens and that one is the seven placer just making sure there's nothing in that oh, there we go so the seven placer is in there so i got four green boats four diamond painting pens with single placers and one seven placer uh, four long strips of wax tweezers with a round end and they fit in there when you're patient with it and don't try and shove it in quickly they actually do all fit in that bag which is really handy really handy to have
and the two stickers I got with DIY Moo, you can see there, um, I might stick them actually to the plastic pack, to my plastic pink mats. Um, there you go, showing the bag again. I really like that bag, that's cute. But yeah, um, two stickers and the uh, little purse or little small pencil case. There we go. I'm having a better go at getting them in, so you can see me getting them in. No idea. Uh, yeah, the two stickers there. Hi, Kinoki. Now on to the uh, unraveling the canvas. And let's see if you... I think I've done well. I think I managed to hide the canvas a bit better from you to see the picture. Yep. <laughs> so this is a 60 by 100 um, and a Dittman um, artist collaboration. Absolutely, absolutely stunning. Loved it, love it, love it, love it. So unrolling it, I've got two bags. Hang on, I'm just trying to find my email on it. Two bags of drills yet again. Labelled up. And I'm actually showing you that black bag is actually the sparkles. I did realise at that point that I didn't have those bags in my first diamond painting. So I had to contact... I did contact DIY Moon Shop and they turned around and apologised and they will be sending me the missing um, drills in the um, in the next stuff they send out. So this is Elsa version B by Anna Dittman and I had what they call special treatment. So I paid extra for the special treatment. And yet again, this was packaged, and you see see them all packaged up. Um, and in DMC code order, which, you know, this process of checking off it is really quick and easy. I actually didn't end up checking the numbers off against the canvases. Um, yeah, I just didn't see any point. But yeah, yet again, 45 colours plus the special drills. So I've got to work out where I want to put those special drills, the sparkly drills. So they actually, DIY Moon calls them electric diamonds. Okay. Now, I have managed, I have managed to pack all the drills with the exception of the sparklies. I've managed to pack all the drills back in the bag. Okay, so the sparklers. Now, so these two bags are only for the one diamond painting. Um, and DIY Moon will be sending me the missing drills for the first canvas. So they're quite heavy, those bags. They're not very big, but they're very heavy. I'm just trying to dig out a diamond painting tray, a drill, a drill tray, a little boat. I did grab up a standard green one and then went, no, I'll do the right thing. And you can see the difference between DIY Moon, which is skinnier and longer. So, let's pour these out. I struggle with the bag. You can see the hand shadows. I should have done animal puppets. Didn't realise how much. Okay, so, I pour them out. And I'll bring them up to the camera and I will do what I can. You can see how sparkly they are, but I just couldn't get the camera to focus on them. So you can see when I tried to get them to, <laughs> to focus and struggled. Even did the nail trick of put my nail in front and get the camera to focus on that, but it wouldn't happen. So I actually gave up on trying to focus that one. I so wanted it to focus. So what I did was I actually tipped back, put some of the drills back, some of the electric diamonds back um, to see if um, 
less sparkles meant that you would be able to see them better and there's quite a lot of weight they are quite heavy so you really know when you're picking them up they are yeah noticeably heavier but here we go still put some more back in only want to keep a couple out some out and let's see if we can focus okay so let's see does this focus look at that And it is folks focusing so you can see how sparkly they are you can actually see on the points of some of them the black that's actually a reflection from um, the, my camera directly above um, but they are beautiful absolutely stunning and they look like what um, has just recently gone out to people um, so some of the bigger youtubers have been sent some some sparklers and I believe that they may be these these diamonds um, but I mean I think I saw these with on the DI moon shop quite a while ago and went oh I'd love some and then at that time I went I can't can't justify spending the money um, and then I started spending noticeably higher amounts of money on single diamond paintings and went well bugger it I might as well and you guys can live vicariously through me with these okay so Back she's showing you the thumbnail and that is Elsa it is stunning and I will roll it up and look at that I'm just looking at that in absolute awe she is gorgeous okay so I'm just pointing out the snowflake in the boxing vlog they actually give me a choice of suggestion of where to put the drills and they are on the snowflakes either put them all on the one top drill and sp spread some around or um, so there we go pointing that out or I um, put it down onto this bottom down there onto that snowflake right there bottom left so yeah she is quite beautiful quite beautiful I do like her so much so there we go I actually stood up to show you so you can see what it's like full frame she pretty <laughs> even now looking at it going oh wow <laughs> okay yeah I was just so wrapped with that so wrapped with that and then bang suddenly I'm here I have picked up girl by carousel so you can now see it a bit better for size wise and that if you actually see it yeah I'm still trying I think it is within a greenhouse like space so now back onto my desk and what I do show you I believe I try to show you the drill the drill field so it's still very sticky I try and show you the, the drill field and yet again my camera was just not happy so I battle there that for a brief little while and it's still not focusing <laughs> it's amazing what we try and do we get we manage to get a cam get our cameras to focus sometimes and then other times we can't get them to focus at all and normally by now I've got it to focus so I've given up on that idea I've covered it back up and just trying to focus yet again just there we go so yet again there is no circles on this one um, they're pretty good symbols on there legend on the left I and I so long as I can get a copy of the legend I very rarely look at that on the side I don't see any point um, 
I've got them on my storage containers. And once I've done a small amount, I tend to get my head around what, what symbols are there. Okay, so you just, uh, I have no idea what I'm saying there. Just more the fact that I'm really impressed, really impressed. Um, I will, I do actually slide this. So you can see her hair at the top. Be interesting to see how her eyes go you know, color wise um, but I've just turned the light off above me to see if you can make it look better and then you I've coiled it up so what I'm about to point out is the fact that you can see her plait comes down and to the other side But yeah, she is stunning. Okay, so she's she's gorgeous. I love her. I'm looking forward to doing her. She'll get kitted up and I'll take her to Cairns. So now I've brought back Girl by Carousel, by the Carousel, because something I didn't do was show you the thumbnail, which you did see with Elsa. Um, but yeah, here we go. Up comes the thumbnail. And does it behave? Sometimes it just didn't behave, but I think because I held actually held it up, um, you've got a good idea on what you see. So hopefully you like. Uh -oh. Hopefully you like what you see. Um, I will give you updates on these as I go, um, but I have a couple of things that I am trying to get done first. Um, but yeah, I hope that you like this. Um, please consider subscribing if you haven't already subscribed. Hit the like button if you like this video. And um, hit the bell to be notified of any further upgrades, uploads, <laughs> upgrades, uploads. Okay, so that's it. Um, thank you very much for watching and to my subscribers thank you for subscribing and to any new subscribers we really appreciate you joining me so keep stay tuned for any further postings of the work on uh, this diamond painting